Hello everybody, SMA Watts here. We're about to continue our Let's Play of the Undead Monk in World of Warcraft. When we last left off, we dealt with the Blight... Well, we learned about the Blight... The lethality levels of the Blight used on South Shore here. And dealt with some angry slimes. Now we're going to find out what we need to do inside Lake Hillsbrad beyond just the Blight Fields. Let's talk to Serge Hinnup. Now they're going to... Oh yeah, I've already read this. Recycling. It's all the craze these days. The Banshee Queen has decreed that we must conserve if we are to prosper as a people. Everyone must do their part, right? With that said, uh, you will be doing our part for us. There will be, there are likely thousands of Blight Canister bits and pieces all over South Shore. We can reuse those canisters for more Blight bombing goodness. Just head into the ruins and pick up whatever you can find. Beware. You probably could have done that when you were sampling the slimes. Shortly before you arrived, an orc flew in on a frostworm and demanded that I direct him to where the newbies were hanging out. Uncertain as to the use of that vernacular, I told him to fulfill his duty as a member of the Horde and deal with the worgen threat on the area. He grumbled something about what the Loktar was cooking and headed south to the docks. Ordinarily, I wouldn't care about whether or not an orc went missing, but I'm genuinely curious to find out what Loktar might be cooking. Go find out. Oh, light canisters. <sighs> Everyone must recycle. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Undead planeteers. Where's mittens? Mittens. Bad cat. Ooh, two of them right next to each other. That just saves work, doesn't it? Uh, no canister over here. You know, it seems to me reusing canisters that have already been heavily impacted and possibly damaged is not safe. They could leak. those canisters. Excellent work, Asherwind. You are incredibly resistant to this blight. We'll have to take you in for testing sometime. No Alright. Let's go find out what the Loktar is cooking. I hope it's stew. I like stew. He was sarcastic. I imagine he'll be nice and sour. Um, can you not swim? Sub, sub. Gasp, help, drowning, gurgle. String. Gurgle, help, gasp. Orcus is drowning. Help me, quest giver, Ashen Wind Club. Dwarf through Orcus in water. Must not die, gurgle. Shame would be too great. Down. Help to explain to Orcus that he's standing in shallow water. I will not survive. Oh, help me. 
Your feet are touching the ground, Orcus. This is shallow water. Just stand up and walk to shore. Go with honor. Oh, yes. Orcus has regained his senses. Foul human mage must have cursed Orcus. Mine, quickly. We must get to shore. Kasha is hurt. That looks like, uh... Kasha, come here. I am fine. Yeah, they should have just given him Shadow Mourn. Kasha, no! Orcus's face turns red as his armor. I, um... The human must have cast some type of mind-altering spell on Orcus. Orcus will explain. Stormpike rent rendezvous. I tracked down the decrepit necromancer Hecular in hopes of getting a lead on the Alliance movement in Hillsbrad. Hecular tasked me with finding and killing Worgen. Ordinarily, this would have been a, not have been a problem for Orcus. But, I had just eaten several helpings of dirge kicking chimera chops, which is super rare, uh, causing my bowels to cry out in anguish. That's when the trouble began, and how I ended up in the water. Here Orcus out, Ashen Wind. For the horde. I just finished making use of the facilities on the dock when... Oh, the Loktar must have been cooking up a turd. By Hellscream's axe. Oh, Lydia. Where were we meeting up with the Ivan Bron Bloodfang fella? And what's in Bronzebeard's name is that terrible smell? They are massing at Purgation Island, just west of here, off the coast. We are to meet them there, General. As for the smell, I think it's coming from over there. Look there, Lydia, wouldn't ma? You face Kingslayer Orcus now, dwarf. Kasha, your master need you now. Enough toying around. Why am I staring at this? Blood and thunder. I mu I will have my revenge, but first we must heal Kasha. Kasha will fly again, National Wind. She must if we are able to claim vengeance. Sadly, Orcus must stay here with Kasha. You must help us, I beg you. Listen carefully, Quest Giver. When I first arrived here, I flew around for days to learn the lay of the land. There was a farm east of here that has long since been abandoned. It's now overrun by gnolls. On this farm grows a special type of mushroom known as mud snout. Go to the stead and gather mud snout for Kasha. Return here when your pack is full. Go forth to victory. Okay. Uh, never mind that there's Naga in between here and there. <sighs> this whole place would fall apart without us. Call us rot brains. Grumble, grumble. Complain, complain. Uh, no, has a red quest heading over its head. That means I've got a quest for killing it. <laughs> or not. Weird. Yeah. 
I thought the red thing was meant they were supposed to be a quest for killing them. Need more mushrooms. <sighs> See, I understand like the whole Kasha thing. Mittens. I mean, if someone was to kill mittens, I'd feel I'd be devastated. Though I suppose I could always get an undead cat. Hmm. We'd have more in common. Don't we mittens, I'm not gonna replace you. You're adorable. Oh, now what happens? Terrible little creatures kill any uh, gnolls. These terrible little creatures are blight upon the land, which is saying a lot. Consider it when you consider that Hillsbred is forsaken territory. Kill as many of the gnolls at Netherlandstead as you can, for the good of the world. I've actually been debating about whether or not I want to turn XP off for like a zone to try and catch back up. Well, actually to try and catch behind would technically be more what I'd be trying to do. But I haven't decided yet. Maybe, um... Maybe once I hit 30, I will turn off experience till... I'm in Athari, at least. Or Rothi. Not Athari. And then again, I suppose the only real problem I'm having is that I'm not getting experience, so... I don't know. I'm going to have to think about it. Do you have any thoughts on whether or not I should turn... Ex I, well, by this point, I should have turned experience on or off so that I know for future videos. Uh, please comment. Do you think I should try and uh, make sure that I'm staying roughly the level for the zones? So, like, once I reach, for instance at 25 for here or 30 for uh, the next place which is called Arathi. You know, basically when I reach the, the top of the zone should I then go and get experience turned off? So just, uh, if you can, if you have a thought or care please, let me know. What do you need? Have you recovered the mud snout? This mushroom is toxic to living things. It provides a restorative boost to the undead. Let's see how Kasha reacts. Move to the spoilers. No. I'll take the Kingslayer's breastplate. Ashen Wind. 
has brought you mud snout blossom kasha eat it and you will be healed go right. with honor feeds kasha the mud his little cheer all right that's gonna do it for this video in the next video we're gonna go ahead and help uh orcus here get revenge and i hope you'll join me for that That didn't look good. <laughs>